friends happy sunday i usually don't vlog on sundays but it is a new week we're a week out from our launch so i thought i would just start on day zero day of rest as we pump up for this week why not take you along to church with me so let's go can you tell that i just had blueberry pancakes today we are carrying our grow and grace tote in this bag today we have my bible Snacks for the road. I made an iced matcha oat latte for me to have at church today. For Sarah? All right, go ahead with the order number for the order. Uh, sorry, I actually don't have it with me. Okay, so I'll need a little bit more information. Sorry. Behind the scenes of our little photo shoot. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Oh my gosh. Sis. He was so nice, the guy. He was a cutie guy. And I was like, I <laughs> good morning good morning happy monday truly feels like the work week has begun i woke up to tons of emails orders are being confirmed things are being delivered this week we're gonna head out in about 10 minutes to go to my printers to pick up the birthday cards that i had offset printed we're having a little breakfast moment i'm supposed to grab lunch with denise i figured i will just keep breakfast very light and small i'm wearing the same dress as i wore yesterday because I think that's just what's gonna happen this pregnancy like i'm gonna be rotating the same three or four outfits because i like what i like and there's no reason to not wear something that i want to wear i just filled up at esso 38 dollars for 19 liters i paid 38 dollars for 19 liters isn't that just insane Insane? Yeah, that only filled like a quarter of my tank, but gas prices are so high right now, like especially in this neighborhood. So I just filled enough to get me like there and back, but that's like crazy. Secured the goods and I'm so excited to check them out when I get home. Yeah, lunchtime. Oh my gosh, would you look at the state of this place? It is absolute chaos in here, but thankfully because it's the basement, it's super cool. Gonna let a little bit of natural light come in. Got tote bags to pack. We have car decals to pack. This is what I picked up from Uline yesterday. So I ordered these corrugated pads and I think they will go well on the back of this. And we have some shrimp ravioli. I realized I just ate a ginormous salad. That was like two hours ago and your girl is hungry again. There just happens to be amazing food at my parents all the time, like all the time. So, um, we're eating. I'm gonna spend the afternoon here just getting things sorted out. Like I'm I'm very, it's very daunting, like all this behind me, slightly making me freak out. And I just brought in 2,000 more birthday cards today. I have yet to fold them, but Lord bless you and keep you card. And then we have our happy birthday card, bloom where you are planted. This is similar design as our tote bag. 
right over there. Our last card is our floral happy birthday card. These are gonna be added to our shelves. And then the overstock, which is in these boxes here, there's about 500 of each card. They live in here. So have all the heavy things down at the bottom. And then the cards are here. I have to actually consolidate all the Mother's Day cards now that we probably won't sell them for a while. We are also still printing these tote bag tags. I've been printing a little bit every time I come just because they take so long and I have to manually feed the paper every single time. Printed enough here. Unfortunately, I don't have enough of these craft sheets, so I might have to get creative later on, but I don't think I'll end up selling all these tote bags all at once anyway, so we've got time. Okay, so I just printed these stickers for my car decals. They're just on plain Avery craft labels, but they have the skew for each of the four designs. And then I have these instructions that I wrote up last week. Just printed them on regular letter sized paper. So I'm gonna cut these, insert them into my packaging. We'll see how it goes. Today's a prototype day, so haven't tried this yet, but I'm excited to see what it's gonna look like. So these are not the prettiest packaging. Like I don't know if Indigo would ever be down to put this on their shelf, but it works for me. Um, so these are eight by eights, and that was like a common denominator against these sizes. I have one of each here. Basically, it's just like so rigid now, right? It's like literally a thick piece of cardboard. I have a plastic sleeve to fit the eight by eight. And then these are the labels. Fortunately, they did not print perfectly evenly, but that's okay. This is like a nice budget way, DIY way to package. And then I have the slip at the back. How cute are these packaged decals? They look good enough for me. I realized on the back of these, I said head over to our YouTube channel for a video and I have not filmed that video yet. So I'm gonna go home and see if I can film a little YouTube tutorial. Feels weird putting one of these on my car when there is no baby yet. Maybe it's not so weird because I am an expectant mother, but yeah, I mean, or maybe I can ask a neighbor if I can borrow their car. Moving with your breath. I just did my first ever Pilates video, recommended to me by my friend Esther. It owned me. It's a prenatal video, so it's for pregnant people. But I don't think I could have even done it if I wasn't pregnant. It was so hard, but it feels good to be moving my body again. I didn't even think I would ever feel the motivation, but I'm feeling the motivation now. I'm currently just stretching out my body and just dreaming about dinner. So yeah, what a what an amazing way to end the day. I was on my feet all day today, so it really does feel good to like stretch it out and move a little bit more intentionally. My dinner. <laughs> Alex's dinner. Look at him. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. We are three days out from our launch. Today's going to be like a stay at home, stay comfy kind of day. I got a lot of listings to write. It's like a lot of admin stuff before the launch. It's gonna be a slow Tuesday. Good morning guys, happy Wednesday. I did not vlog yesterday. I actually got tons of work done and I was just on my computer the whole day basically. I'll show you some of the stuff I did get to finish. Did a bunch of my product photography. Product photography is so hard. It's probably one of the most stressful and challenging things about my work. Don't mind the mess behind me. You are now sitting on my slanted oven. But yeah, product photography is super hard for me. Like, I don't know, like maybe I just don't have like a good confident setup, but I just didn't feel like filming. We are currently making my breakfast oatmeal. I actually have a doctor's appointment today. So we have week 24 ultrasound. It's wild. Like I never imagined being 24 weeks pregnant. Praise God, like I'm so thankful that he has sustained me to this point that our baby girl is 24 weeks already. Like I, it's really exciting. Another reason why I didn't film yesterday is because I actually felt sick like all day. Like I kid you not, I felt kind of like, I don't know what it was, like nausea. Like I just did not feel good. I think it's because I stopped taking diclectin again. Diclectin is like the 
anti-nausea pregnancy drug and I've been living off of it for the past 24 weeks basically. And every time I try to stop or wean myself off thinking that it'll be okay, it hasn't been okay. So for about 36 hours, I stopped taking Diclectin and then yesterday I just started feeling like not good. And I think it's a mix of the Diclectin but also like the AC being very cold. Like I think I was starting to get like cold-ish symptoms. Took Diclectin before bed yesterday and I feel perfect now, so. Here is our oatmeal shot of the day. Another thing is I actually haven't made coffee at home in like five days because I've been just drinking matcha and I've been really enjoying it. Like, I don't know what it is. I just have not been craving coffee these days. Matcha has less caffeine, so that's good for me. But anyway, all this to say, today is a coffee day. Maybe it's because I felt so crappy yesterday. I'm like, I need a coffee today. Like a real hit, you know? Here I am eating breakfast alone again. Today we're on, I think, Genesis 11 on our Bible reading plan. And this is the aftermath of yesterday's kind of chaotic photo shoot. On Sunday, I asked my sister to pose and I edited some of them. This is from yesterday and, sorry, they're by SKU. But I think they turned out so well. I basically put, like for this shot, basically put two colors side by side. I have to Photoshop it. The paper, like this backing paper is much smaller. Like it goes right up to the edge of the bag. So I Photoshopped it so that it expands out. These are real shadows. I just think they turned out so well. You live and you learn. You just gotta keep trying. These product shops turned out much better than previous attempts at photography. And they were all taken with my iPhone. Really don't need fancy cameras or anything. I bought like these $2 sheets from Desairs, like colored backing sheets. To be fair, I do pay for Adobe Lightroom and Photoshop and I've been getting better and better at using those programs and I know that can be like a big investment mentally and financially. Just finished my ultrasound and waiting for a picture and then I'm gonna go see a doctor. Okay, it's quite late. It is 9.50 p.m., but we're back home. My newsletter for tomorrow morning is going out at 5, 10 a.m. for all my subscribers, and there's a little treat in there. Took me a while to set this one up. Also, like, wearing this very embarrassing dress. Maternity dress that my mom wore when she was pregnant with me. Literally, like, so scrappy, but super comfy. I'm wearing it now. I spent four hours at the hospital today, and I was just so tired. I just like vegged out on the couch for a while and now i have a second wind of energy which is why i'm finally getting to the to-do list that i had to do today i thought launch week would be a lot more like fun and like a lot going on like so chaotic but really it's a lot of me sitting on my computer and getting my shop ready like preparing listings preparing like discount codes and kind of optimizing my website a lot of admin work so that's the life alex and i are on our way to my parents for the day it's late afternoon we have some personal things this morning. We are less than 24 hours until launch. Things are pretty much good to go. I have a few loose ends to tie up. Okay, we're gonna try to attempt an instructional video for how to stick this onto your car. Clearly we don't have a baby on board, but technically there is a baby on board at all times these days. So just doing a little clean before we begin because it was like really dirty. <laughs> Are we ready to do this? Isn't it like here? Mm -hmm. yeah, card. Ta da! Love eating at my mom's. Tofu, squid, fish, zucchini. Cucumbers, kimchi. We made it. We are in the basement. I've got tons of boxes to unbox. I'm, I threw on a tank top on top of my dress. Just feeling kind of exposed, even though I'm by myself. Alex went out, 
got me a little treat. Delivery from Clear Bags. Oh my gosh. The backing boards that came in finally. I outsourced the printing for my 16 by 20 prints because I had to. I don't have a printer that can print this big. I adjusted the colors a little bit right before giving them my final files. So really hoping they turned out okay. Oh, I appreciate how flat they packaged everything. They look nice. Alphabet poster, Fruit of the Spirit posters, the baby alphabets, oh my gosh. They turned out great. I think we're ready to launch the baby collection. Helping me pack. So I have some of my bags up there. It's honestly not a lot, maybe like 20 of them. And then the rest are being stored in boxes. So we have that box, this box. Hi friends, I debated filming myself wearing this pajama from Korea, but it is what it is. I'm pooped. Like I think I almost overworked myself maybe and I think that's a lesson. Like I should not overwork myself while pregnant because it's just like I'm actually exhausted. But we got a lot done. I got to take advantage of Alex's muscles. Just gotta do a few little things before tomorrow's launch. Having a peeing butt party. Whoa. Wow. Well, we are finally editing some of that footage from this afternoon's little session. So, filmed like myself cleaning my car and like blah blah blah. And I'm gonna cut this down, but first I'm gonna try to do a voiceover. And I am using my Yeti Blue mic, which I love. It's just so easy to set up. And yeah, these are the pills I need to take for my nighttime. This thing is still very fizzy from like a week and a half ago, a week ago, and it's good. I'm sitting in complete darkness because the sun has set and I'm too lazy to turn on that light. But take a look at this. I actually put in a lot more effort than I thought and I added subtitles. He says, come off with your clear layer. Just grab a pair of tweezers and affix it. Back. Thank you again for purchasing our car decal and stay safe on the roads. Bye. How cute is that? Thought it would just be a quick little video and you know, it kind of seems worth the extra effort. Happy Friday. It is the morning of our big shop launch. The shop went live like an hour-ish ago and have a handful of orders that came in first thing. Thank you so much. Yeah, I mean, today's gonna be a pretty chill day. Like everything's done, everything's ready. <gasps> ew, 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 ew. Look at the avocado. Oh my gosh. This is just not fair. This one's not feeling so hot either. The skin is just... Alex, look, look at this. Is this not the nastiest thing you've ever seen? This one's not feeling so hot either. Not great, but better than the other two. That's sad, that was like a whole batch. They're smashing them as well. Mm. Here's one. This last one doesn't get as much. Cheers! Launch days are always weird. Like I'm always so excited and nervous. Like there's a lot of anticipation. I don't know what you guys are imagining, but orders are not like piling in. Like it's very slow and steady. And I'm just trying to be thankful for every order that comes in. Chicken up on our plants. Look how much they grew since last week. 
We are here at Tokyo Cheesecake. We switch out their cards every few weeks. This guy does at least. Thank you. It's time for Alex Cam. I'm gonna sit in the car. Hello. It's time for Alex Cam. Hello. Don't mind the dirtiness. Hello. I just came into my basement and all these car stickers are packed. Oh man, I asked my dad to do some last night and he did all of these. Wow, thanks dad. God bless his soul. Good thing I picked up ink today. I like to keep a full stock of ink here just in case and we are running low of photo magenta. So here it goes. Do I look haggard? Um, because I feel haggard. It's been like maybe six hours since I got here and I have just been packing, organizing. I'm very grateful for the orders that came in today. Thank you to you all who ordered on the first day. You'll probably get your order in the next week or so. I'm gonna try to dispatch them all this weekend, but look how cute these cards are. Oh my gosh, I'm packing box sets of these baby cards and I cannot get over. How cute they are day and the week is almost ending for me here i don't know when to end the vlog because i don't know what i'm gonna do tonight but if i don't get to say bye please consider this my formal goodbye i will see you next time in a week or so thank you so much for being with me during such an important week bye guys bye.